And hello again. It's time to get even more answers about the damn chip in our head. He's all yours. I'll give you two some space. I hope we can come to an understanding. That is certainly in your best interest. V, I will remember this. Well, nah, this heat. Put a check mark My next throat is positively parched. Now we gotta. Mm. V, yeah. give you what the? the Fuck! That is not me. You will see the difference. I will give you two buckets. No, uh, no need. <laughs> Sit down, <laughs> goddammit! Damn, we're fine. No, they're a trimester cramp. Ha ha ha. Joke away. But you look pretty spent. I feel pretty spent. Fuck! That was your ticker. Sit and rest. Don't need your flat lining while we got a job to do. Blah, blah, blah. Fuck Arasaka, blah, blah. Smash Makoshi. You really are turning into me. I can't say I'm excited, because you're a manipulator, an egotist, and a cynic. Every time you open your mouth, you gotta bury someone. You know, we get along as the need arises. Maybe it's time you started trusting me more. You can be a charming guy. Just make the effort. Charisma flows. Then I remember that nuke that you detonated downtown without a second thought. And no hint of later remorse. It was Makoshi I was after. Wanted to destroy it. Gave Sokka ample time to clear the building. No, V's right about You that. knew countless people would die. Don't kid yourself. Johnny is a weird fucked up person. Take lives aplenty yourself. Sea scale is a problem. <clears throat> Whatever. Won't argue. All I'm saying is you're unpredictable. You it's not always good. Kettle. Remember where you used to be, then think what you've done lately. Path clear. See where you're going? <laughs> Got no idea where I'm going. Yeah. Be a living legend. <laughs> That's all I wanted. Feels like I'm barely surviving. Yeah. Test of a person's true value? Death. Facing it. Staring it down. You still got a chance to be somebody. Yeah. Maybe. What was it like when you died? Was on top of the world. Failure not an option, not a thought. Till it happened. Death feels real now. It's only now I know it. Now. I had half a century to come to terms. Makoshi felt, I don't know, like sleep? Lacked awareness, had no sense of passing time, didn't mark it, did what they wanted to me. I just remember cold, black void, fear. Or, or was that your death? Makoshi, why did Arasaka even build it? If I could only <laughs> see inside Saburo's head. <laughs> People can be bought, brainwashed, but it's only in Makoshi that you can peer inside a soul, pick it apart, reprogram it. You know they've amassed quite a collection. Scary talented runners, soul killed, packed away, probably using them now, probably controlling them. So wool in hearts and minds, that's what it's about. Uh, the usual. Corpse have always tried to shackle people one way or another. Saburo's ambition is greater. He's out to control humanity. Well, think I get why you detest the place. Shouldn't exist. 
Of all the destruction and pain corpse wreak around the world, what happens at Makoshi is worst. Yeah, but that's how the world you know is, Johnny. Why? They can change who you are, turn you into someone else without you even knowing it. Yep, goddamn right. See. Corpse yeah, see. have already taken the world for their own. Now they're coming for us. Realize what you're doing to me is what Arasaka's doing at Makoshi. Yeah, I know. That's why I'm gonna fix it. Let's move. Get back to work. I guess we need to do it. Let's do it. He, he's right on that point. Especially like no, this is also what I love, like this question of morale, like like what is right, what is wrong, because this this is the faint line where it starts to not make sense anymore. Where it's like where human moral is taking you. So I guess I got a shit ton of time left. Holy hell. Mm. Oh yeah, we got the Judy job still. This is X Fact. Dr. Johnny. <sighs> yeah, so many gigs, so many, you know, things to do. I think I'll do this area next. And then I'll probably do this area next. And last I'll do uh, Westbrook. I think I'll do uh, Santo Domingo, then I'll do Haywood, and then I'll do uh, that. I'll do this last. I'll do Docktown last, and this little part. This is all the progress. I probably will unlock it at some point for uh, more of Mr. Hands' stupid jobs. But well, it ended pretty piss poor for us. And a pretty piss poor for us. But you know what? You know what we got? We got more for reflexes. Wide open. Yeah. I yeah. feel pretty wide open. Spread pretty wide open. Uh, half being half dead, you know. Um, I can't, I can't remember putting this one. This is the one we want to drive with. No way. Put this there. Put this there, and put this there, put this there. Maybe I should take the time and level up these guns so they're all at least level 6. Because everything else that I get is a 6er. Still don't have any of those fucking scopes that I want. And no muzzle. That is on level five. It's like, what's that shit? Uh, so, what am I doing next? Probably something. You know, probably this gig, then this job, and then these jobs. These three in a row, and this, this. I think that would be like the smartest kind of thing. Maybe not in this part. I don't think so. But I can drive there, you know, waste a little bit of time. Let things space out a little. And then we'll see. Let's 
So, I don't get what's happening to me in this city. Free to do whatever I want with... I want to... I want with my life, but fuck. Am I really free? Am I left? Because things start to get a little inconvenient. That would mean I'm always just going to be running. Does that make sense? You know, sometimes you need to face the problem. I always get along with sun scorning, but it's true, you'll see. Yeah, hey, sometimes you gotta face the people that you have problems with. Or think you have problems with. Sometimes uh, you just interpret something really wrong. You know, conflict is part of life. Conflict doesn't always mean that you have to, like, punch someone in the face or ha have, like, a, a, a conflict where you're about to kill each other or some shit like this. You know, conflict doesn't always mean that you have to murder people. And while saying this, I just murdered a couple of people. See? Sometimes you just gotta talk things out. As shitty and uh, literally as, as V said, as corny as it sounds. Sometimes it's the only thing you can do. Sometimes you gotta face things. You can't always run away from things. And I th I'd, I'd say generally most people wanna try uh, to get away from conflict. Like, I think nobody likes conflict in any sort of way. It's my, uh, you might believe it's not that way, but most people wanna shy away from conflict. It, it's easy to misunderstand each other. And there are some conflicts you, you literally can't solve without a fight. Like, a literal fight. It, it, it is something that happens. Hello, we haven't met. I'm Elizabeth. My yeah. husband and I, we need a somewhat delicate matter handled. We think you could help. Mind my asking who your husband is? Actually, who are you? I'd rather not discuss details over the phone. Please, meet with us. We'll explain everything. As I said, it's a rather delicate matter. What's so delicate about the matter? I'd rather discuss that in person, if you don't mind. Can we meet? Sure, let's do that. I'll send you the address. See you. I fought the law. The fuck is that? Oh, we got a cyber cycle there. Ooh, if I would have seen this before, I would have done it. For fuck's sake. But I haven't done all of them, so maybe that's something. Yeah, we'll do this in another part. We'll do this next so I think I can set it off here so until the next time see ya